my students and I are motivated. Um, <clears throat> yeah, how would I describe our motivation? That's a good question. Are they motivated? I think I motivate them sort of like perhaps, um, I don't know, one of those small little uh, le cars that you see driving down the road. You know, what motivates that? It's just this little tiny car, but yet it, it moves. It's motivated to run. I would say that probably is very similar. outside we're going to be talking about waves today and as you look outside we see the sun is shining the sun is an example of a wave when you're out in the sun it sort of makes you want to wave so it was like the typical waves. Monday afternoon we were in physics class and it was a beautiful day outside and so mr. G in his typical attitude said Let's go outside and find something to do and enjoy the weather while making it look like it's kind of educational and constructive at the same time. And so we went outside, we enjoyed the sun, and I laid down on the grass and kind of took a nice little quick nap, and Mr. G, to test the Doppler effect, he drove his car right by us in front of the senior parking lot and, well, he was probably speeding, so good thing a cop car wasn't around. That's right. I was demonstrating the Doppler effect. And as I drove by, the horn got louder, and then as I passed, it got quieter. Frequency. Not the sound changed due to the uh, Doppler effect. <laughs> and the sky was blue. All of that was waves, and I did, if I remember, I believe I waved at you when I drove by. Hmm, no, I really have no agenda. Often I don't even have lesson plans. Okay, what does that mean? That means, <laughs> what is he doing? Uh, so, what are you doing? What instrument thing do you have down there? Is it a cell phone? No, it's a calculator. <laughs> Anyhow. <laughs> okay, so tuning for if I... Noises I make in class usually come as a result of me hating my existence in this school. And I have to uh, vocalize that um, through these different sounds. I've always wondered why when you melt some cheese, it's like stringy. But then other cheese, it's not. I think that would be something that should be investigated further. <laughs> 